What's going on everybody? Baxter here from Nelly and Baxter's Pokemon and today we're gonna take a stroll along the beach. Yeah, we're gonna take a stroll along Poke Beach, see what kinds of goodies are coming up our way. We are in the midst of post Crimson Invasion release, so as just about every Pokemon TCG fan, as soon as this set is dropped, we are already looking forward to the next one, which I guess kind of has good reason, you know, Crimson Invasion, uh, when compared to, in my opinion, compared to Burning Shadows and, of course, Guardians Rising, it was just a little bit lackluster. Some cool cards in there nonetheless, though. Um, but we have some Sun and Moon uh, 5 coming up. Yeah, I believe that's supposed to be uh, released in February. But there's a few things I want to share with you more uh, specifically these Prism Star Pokemon, which as you can see, we just have news of the new Lunala Prism Star Pokemon. So let's check this out. Lunana, L Lunala, excuse me, Psychic type Pokemon. The HP is 160, but check this out, guys. I just want to highlight this right here. It is being released as a basic Pokemon. You're not having to evolve from Cosmog all the way up. So let's take a look at this new rule for the Prism Star. So we're introducing yet another mechanism. We just got the GX mechanism uh, when... The base set was released. Here we go with another mechanism. We have the Prism Star rule. You can't have more than one Prism Star card with the same name in your deck. If a Prism Star card is discarded, put it in the Lost Zone. So I'm assuming this Lost Zone is separate from the discard to where you cannot get it back for the remainder of the game. There is nothing you can do. It is gone forever and ever. And so, yeah, you can only play one prism star card of the same name so no four copies like normal cards for one psychic energy we have full moon star for each of your opponent's pokemon in play attach a psychic energy from your discard pile to your pokemon in any way you like so for each one that you have in play so the active as well it will obviously the active would be this lunala but then your bench then we have for four psychic energy psy storm 20 damage this attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to all pokemon in play holy toledo guys that reminds me of the psy storm attack that del fox has from fates collide except instead of four energy it's three colorless energy and so the weakness is darkness so not psychic that's actually kind of nice and it is resistant to fighting type pokemon so Solgaleo and Lunala have the same first attack, but themed for uh, their respective types. So we'll sure we'll come across Solgaleo. I've already actually been looking into that, guys. I am definitely going to be uh, revamping Solgaleo. Here we go. The Return of the Lost Zone. So this is an older mechanism. Uh, let's see. The first Prism Star card has been revealed for Japan. Sun Moon 5 set. Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. The set will be released in Japan on December the 8th which means it will come out a couple of months later in the States. But Solgaleo, same thing, HP for 160 as a basic Pokemon. There's a the Prison Star rule again. Um, same exact attacks, except for the second one, which is 4 Metal Energy. Left, uh, right here is what I'm talking about, guys. The second attack, 4 Metal Energy, Corona Impact, 160 damage. This Pokemon can't attack during your next turn. But if you're running it with big Solgaleo GX, you can just Ultra Road and switch it out. So, let's take a look at this Lost Zone. The Lost Zone returns. Once a card is in the Lost Zone, there's no way to get it back. It is a special discard pile. The mechanic was first introduced in Platinum back in 2009. It was inspired by the distortion world of Pokemon Platinum. It's usually associated with Giratina because of the set's Sinnoh theme and the reintroduction of the Lost Zone. I bet we'll get a Giratina soon. Alright. Very, very cool. I am actually, you know... I am looking forward to this. I I really like Solgaleo, so I'm probably gonna. You guys may see a Sunday showdown up against Nanelli. Shh, do not tell her anything. Um, but yes, totally thinking of um of revamping our Solgaleo. Come on, let's go back to the main page. Sorry guys, let's just go. Poke beach. There we go. We'll go back to the main page. What's this next thing we have here? Shining Legends Collection. Ooh, a shiny dark ride. GX. Check it out. Okay, now for some exclusive news. Shining Legends merchandise is going to continue into March with the release of the new Shining Legends Collection. Shiny dark ride. 
GX. It'll hit store shelves in America and Europe on March the 9th, just after tax season. Giggity, giggity. It'll come with a shiny Dark Ride GX promo, a jumbo version 4, shiny legend packs, and a PTC GO code card. The shiny Darkrai GX promo will likely be an alternate version of the Darkrai GX from Burning Shadows. Alright, so. Very, very cool. Very cool. Let's see, what kind of other goodies do we have? The Sinnoh starters, huh? Set to focus on the Sinnoh region? I wonder why. Maybe it has something to do with the anime, because I honestly, I, I start watching the anime, and I totally forget to like go back and watch it. Five new cards from Sun and Moon 5, Ultra Moon, and Ultra Sun have been revealed. Turtwig, Piplup, Chimchar, and two Unit Energy, which are basically new versions of Blend Energy. This is pretty cool, guys. So basically what it is, is it has... I can't remember either three or four energy on the card, and it will provide those energies for whatever Pokemon it's attached to. So expect to see a lot of people breaking that golden rule of one or two types of Pokemon, and we're going to see a much more diverse collection. Also, or not collection, but diverse uh, deck builds. Also, I was hoping they'd do something to help out our Dragon-type Pokemon, because outside of the Alolan Executor GX... There really isn't anything to help um, our dragon types get powered up, okay? So, I was hoping that maybe they bring back double dragon, but what's better than that? This uh, unit energy. So, pretty cool. The, uh, let's see. The franchise is advertising Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon right now. So, why the TCG is choosing to focus on the Sinnoh region is quite the mystery. Maybe getting Diamond or Pro remakes? I would not be opposed to that. Hmm. So... Interesting, interesting, interesting. Let's jump back and see. Uh, what? What else? Why? Why? Why are we not jumping back? So, well, let's see. We've got a new Solgaleo with the uh, Prism Pokemon. We've got a new Lunala. Ashes uh, promos and plush available. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Um, Hmm, Team Rainbow Rocket, what's this all about? Let's see, let's see, let's see. A new Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon trailer was released. The big news dump will be revealed on Friday, November the 10th. Meet Team Rainbow Rocket and Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Let's check this out, guys. Hmm, thanks, Giovanni. Team Rainbow Rocket, what's this about? Giovanni strikes back. This is new here. So it's just on the set my plans to get the blue. Huh. Lysander. So are we gonna see Jesse and James? Rent them, huh? What, what is this all about? What is this all about? Hmm. What are your thoughts on this, guys? Let me know in the comments below. Hmm, ninja. Legendary birds, very nice. Wow, they're bringing everybody. The, the gang is back. What? What? Hmm. I don't know what to make of this, guys. What do you got? What do you think? Beltalm, Xerneas, Zygarde. U2X, U2Y, Mega Evolving, Sweet, I can hear Tino in there, Latios, the Primal Fish, Groudon. Hmm. Oh, that's right around the corner. Rainbow, I'm gonna look more into that, guys. Rainbow Rocket. Let's see what else we got on this page for today. We got a Lucario box coming out in February. Let's check that out. Because there isn't a Lucario GX yet. A new Lucario GX box will be released in America and Europe on February the 23rd. 
It'll come with an ever foreseen fall promo of Lucario GX, a jumbo card, four booster packs, and PTC GO code card. No Lucario GX has been announced for Japan yet, so this is the first we're hearing of it. This is the first English TCG product announced for 2018 with a solid release date. It's also the first brand new TCG product announced for 2018. There hasn't been a new Lucario card in several years. Like Mewtwo, Gardevoir, and Darkrai. So it's good we're finally getting one. But there was a Lucario in Burning Shadows. Maybe they mean like GX, EX. I don't know. Um, but I thought there was supposed to be a Raichu GX box for Shining Legends coming out in January. Like it got pushed back or something. Because you know I'm on the lookout for the full art. Uh, Raichu. So let's see, let's see. Mm, 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 mm. New World Championship decks coming out. Um, what what are your guys' takes on those? I, I bought one like years ago. Uh, it's kind of cool. But you, you can't use them in like... Um, like com competitions or anything. But they're kind of cool to have the world's decks to be printed uh, the world's decks to be printed this year or the masters winner diego with the uh ridiculous flipping guard of war deck the masters runner up with galissa pod and garb door senior winner with ice path and samurai sniper so pretty neat decks but i don't know i guess they're kind of cool to have um oh this is what i wanted to show you guys so Shauna Bay is getting replaced by Cynthia. A new Cynthia car will be included in November 10th starter set Soul Galeo GX and Lunala GX. Thanks goes to Jake C for this translation. Cynthia is a trainer supporter. Shuffle your hand into your deck and then draw six cards. Not like Shauna Bay who gave you five. Cynthia loves you a little more and gives you six. You may only play a one support card during your turn the, uh, the card is a reprint of professor oak's new theory from heart gold soul silver whoa that set goes back uh since it's being released with the package deck there won't be a full art cynthia for now okay our first opportunity to get this card outside of japan will be an ultra ultra prism set in february so that's our next big release guys um, very cool, very cool. Cynthia will definitely be used in um, in a few decks. So here's the next set, though, guys. Is a uh, Ultra Prism that'll be in February. Okay. Um, but anyway, about Cynthia, I, I definitely am going to be using that. Um, since Sean is going to be out of rotation after this year, um, and Hall is just kind of lame because you can't really. You can't maximize it unless you've used your GX move. Anyway, I'm rambling. Let's see what else we have here. Um, we got five new Ultra Beasts, looks like, coming. A new mechanic, which I think is has to do with the Lost Zone or whatever. But, yeah, lots and lots of news. Woo! There! I want to take a look here. We are getting gold cards, you guys. Gold um, Soul Galeo Gold Lunala. Check this out. I'm so stoked for this. Soul Galeo is probably what my favorite Pokemon from the Sun and Moon base set. Same ability, Rainbow, or not Rainbow Road. Wow, see, I was thinking it's all Rainbow Rock. Uh, anyway, Ultra Road ability and Sun Steel Strike for 230 and the Soul Burst GX move. Same exact attacks, but yes, I want that card. I need it. Very, very cool. All right, guys, I think I've rambled enough. Lots of cool stuff coming out for Pokemon Sun and Moon. Uh, early, er, not early, but beginning of 2018. I look forward to cracking these packs, um, especially after Crimson Invasion was kind of a dull, um, I guess, drop after the previous Sun and Moon sets. So we're going to get back on it with Ultra Sun and Moon Prism. Very cool. Thank you for joining me with this Poke Beach discussion. This has been Baxter with the Nelly and Baxter's Pokemon. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all of those that are subscribed to our channel and are following us on Instagram. It means the world to us. If this is your first time on our channel, please consider subscribing to Nelly and Baxter's Pokemon. Lots of cool stuff going on in this channel, guys. Um, product openings, deck profiles, battles, Poke Beach discussions like the one today. 
Um, so yeah, consider subscribing to us. Good times on this channel. Thanks for joining me. Have an awesome day.